this is the frame of our sweat lodge. The sweat lodge is a ceremonial practice that is done by many different tribes. And we do very different versions of it all the time. We bring different elders in and they show us all their ways. Our community wanted culture and language to be part of their students' daily lives in order to increase their engagement and their sense of self. The struggles of being Native and people don't understand your culture or understand things that are going on, it's hard to live in two worlds. This has brought our worlds together. The data that we found reflected that students do better when they're being reflected in their curriculum and when they have teachers that reflect their identity. I definitely have thrived here more. Before I used to hate math and I didn't really like subjects like that or other normal teachings, you know. But here I've actually been able to learn it and I've actually gotten really better at it. And I'm on the honor roll now. I'm getting better grades than I would before, you know. I was totally just blown away and proud of her and I told her, you know, all I asked was for her to do her best and what they brought out of her and her best is amazing. Now she's she's thriving in everything she as she's excelling. I cannot say enough what the staff means to the school. They're the heart of our school. They absolutely have um, created a place, a safe place for our students to be exactly who they were created to be. Um, and it is not an understatement for me to say that they're saving lives. Our school has shown that our model is working for our kids, for our kids to show 300% academic growth from beginning of year just to middle of year. Imagine what our scores would be at the end of the year. Imagine what our scores could be in a few years of operating. Well, our enrollment numbers are going way up next year, which is great, but it also means that we will have a budget shortfall because those numbers will not be reflected for several months into the next school year. Like We've created something that's working for our kids and we can't dangle hope in front of our community and let it go away. We need to see this project through to its full fruition and we need to serve as many kids as possible. And we can't do that without the support of our community. Just prayed and sang. We wished for the wellness of our community. We have fought so incredibly hard to just exist that we have to make sure that it doesn't go away, that the, our grandchildren and our great-grandchildren have the opportunity to be a part of something that will absolutely change um, our state, our tribal nations, and really the wellness of our people.